My name is Lucas Sardenberg. I'm the product marketing consultant for Caterpillar for the mid-size loaders. So mid-size loaders, as we call in CAD, is basically the 950 model all the way to the 982. It came with the M-Series back in 2014. Okay, and M-Series was basically an improvement over the uh, previous generation, you know, a large improvement. And now with the product updates, what we're doing is that we're taking all the features, instead of waiting for a big new product to come, we're saying let's add the features as the years goes by. Up to the 972, you have, you know, manual front differential locks. Okay, so this is a feature that before was considered optional, now it's standard on those machines. On the M-Series as well, we brought the lockup clutch torque converter, you know, very fancy word, but basically means almost like a direct drive. And the main advantage is that on load and carry, climbing up ramps and everything, it provides a lot more fuel. The other big features we added to the cab, you know, it's concerned to safety. Brian explained a little bit, right, the new cat steps that I show here, you know, 11 times stronger. A lot of times you see damaged steps on the job sites. We wanted to address that. We went to the corporate steps, still what we call self-cleaning. The mud can get out without getting trapped in here. Uh, we also had added some nice features to the cab. Before I open the cab door, you know, there's a cutout on the structure there for a tie-off harness. Why? Because a lot of times you want to clean that windshield and everything. Regulations require you to have a tie-off point, so we added that tie-off point to the machine itself in the interest of safety. So a lot of that is small details, but they make the difference, right? With the M-Series, we also offered the switch here, so basically the switch opens the cab door for you. When I opened the cab, the lights came, back, came on on the back. Again, another customer requirement that basically came to us and said, wouldn't it be great if the lights came on? Because I'm usually coming to the machine, it's dark, sometimes it's rainy and everything. And when I open, at least the lights come on, I can see what's happening, I can see around the machine. So we added this feature, you know. Looks like small things, but once you combine all those small things, it, it's a significant update. Another feature you saw that is the green light. Basically, every time you're running a machine, with the seat belt, it's green on the top. So if you see somebody running that machine without the light on, you know he's running without the seat belt, which is one of the most common citations from MSHA, for instance, right? Not wearing the seat belt. So now, even if you're the job supervisor or the superintendent sitting in the office all the way up on the hill, if you look down and you see the machine doesn't have that light on, you know somebody's operating without the seat belt, okay? Before you still, you still receive an alert via vision link saying, the machine is running without the product link on, but now this, just by looking at the machine, you can tell. The last item I want to talk is about the new hood, right? So the previous series had that clamshell hood that opened on the back like this, right? We keep the same functionality, so basically the same accessibility to the cooling cores and the engine and everything, but instead of having the two piece, now we have just this one piece hood, and it's made of the new material, so it's not metallic anymore. It's basically the same ones, you know, the fender and the hood, you know? Test it on the cold, test it for vibration and everything to meet the requirements. You visit PPG and see how we test the machines. So, really nice material. And the good news is that if you have an earlier version M series with the steel fenders, you can still retrofit the new generation fenders or the new generation hood.